This quick video will show you how to use Google Spreadsheets. The first thing you're going to do when using anything Google is to go to google.com and click sign in. From here, you're going to go ahead and enter your school email address. So this for students is firstname.lastname at nisdtx.org. Then you're going to go to next. From here, you're going to sign in like you would on your computer. So for students, that's firstname.lastname and then ID number. Now you can see that I am signed in up in the top right hand side of the page and if I click the apps button and drive this is going to take me to a place where I can upload files and create new files in Google. So one of my options when I go to new is going to be able to create a Google Sheet. Google Sheets are going to be very similar to a Microsoft Excel document. So once this loads, you can actually go ahead and give your Google Sheet a title. And from here, you can type in your functions, you can go in and add your values, anything that you need to, um, sim very similar to Microsoft Excel. And the great thing about Google Sheets is that you can actually share with other people in your group and you can all be working on it at the same time. So when I click on the share icon, I can then insert emails of other people in my group Okay, or you can also even go to get shareable link and you could share one link with an entire group of people um, just by emailing them the link or putting that link where everybody can get to it. So notice that there's choices for anybody in ISD can view, comment, or edit. So you choose how you want to share the document and then send. It's important to know that everything that you do in Google saves automatically and then can be found in your drive. So if you've created it, it's going to be in my drive. And if somebody else has shared with you, it will be in the shared with me section. So now I can go down and find that I'm going to have a test Google Sheet that we just created. And I've actually made several. But this is where you would locate your document. 